Solaiha from Bangladesh. My husband is revered and practicing Islam for two years. He is studying fiqh now without learning Arabic. So he does not pronounce the letter Ain properly in Salah. Even I can't pronounce properly. So our, our prayers valid until we learn. And my husband requests you to recite Fatiha. He likes your recitation. Okay, first of all, Allah says in the Quran, فَاتَّقُوا اللَّهَ مَسْتَطَعْتُمْ Fear Allah to the best of your ability. Someone who is unable to pronounce Al-Ain correctly. What should we do? Oh, you're a kafir, don't pray. No, of course not. Allah Azza wa is the most merciful, most forgiven. So, you can recite it to the best of your ability. Maliki Yawmiddin. Ihdina al Sirat al Mustaqim. Sirat al Ladina and Amta Alayhim. And Amta. I'm unable to pronounce the Ain. This is my ability. You have no problem. Your prayer is valid. Now, what a lot of the reverts and even the Arabs do, they practice outside the prayer. An Amta. An Amta. An Amta. They repeat it a thousand times. غَيْرِ الْمَغْضُوبِ غَيْرِ الْمَغْضُوبِ And they keep on doing this and after a few days it becomes usual and perfect بِإِذْنِ اللَّهِ عَزَّ وَجَلْ